Five ways to celebrate Easter in the Czech Republic. You also can celebrate Easter like a Czech because I'm going to teach you how. Let's get started. An American living in Czechia. Checking with Katrina. Number one, kraslice. Kraslice is colored Easter eggs. But Czechs don't simply just color the Easter eggs. They actually paint them. And let me show it to you. In this setup, you have your heating pan with the wax here with this little cup. And you just drop the wax in and let the wax get all melted. Then you have these pencils. I'm sure they probably sell actual real tools to do this somewhere, but my mother-in-law has these things, pencils with pins with different size tips. So you take your egg that's been blown out and made howl. People take it and they take a little knife, they poke it on each side and then they just blow out all the inside. It's actually difficult. I tried it one year. Ooh, it is working and it's not breaking. Do you see the hole? Yeah, let's pop that yolk. See if we can pop that yolk. Hmm. I don't think it's working. <laughs> oh, I figured it out. Apparently you really gotta wrap your lips around that thing so the air doesn't go out the sides of your mouth and actually goes into the egg. I'm getting it. Almost there. I did it. I'm quite proud of myself. I become more and more like a Czech every day. I didn't have to do any of these because my mother-in-law does them all for me, so that's nice. I did this once before, but it was like four or five years ago, so I don't really remember exactly how. I don't know, I kind of suck at this. <laughs> yeah, I suck. <laughs> Let's try to put another one right here. Oops, that really looks bad. <laughs> oh well. It's all about the fun, right? It's not like I'm trying to sell mine. I'm just trying to put them in a basket and enjoy them for Easter. The next step in making these Easter eggs is to drop them in food coloring. So we have six different colors and we have six different jars. So once your eggs are colored, then it's time to take off the wax. For that, you're gonna need your hot plate again and some paper towels. So you simply take your egg, you just put it near the heat so that you can heat the wax up. And once the wax is hot and melted again, you simply wipe it off. And as you can see, the wax just gently wipes right off. Make sure you stay till the end because I have a bonus way to celebrate that's usually only done in Moravia, which is the eastern part of Czechia. Number two, lamb. To celebrate Easter like a Czech, you should eat lamb for Easter dinner. If you can't get your hands on a lamb, then just eat young meat like veal or a baby bunny. Which I know it doesn't sound very nice, but young rabbit. Let's say it that way. Oh boy, dead rabbit! Dead rabbit! But Czechs love to enjoy lamb when celebrating Easter. Lamb represents the whole point of Easter, Jesus being the sacrificial lamb. Which brings us to number three, Branek. Mm, Years ago, there were many Czechs who couldn't afford lamb or find one, so they made Branek. Branek is simply a cake made from flour, eggs, and sugar in the shape of a lamb. You too can make Branek, and here's how. So what you're going to need for this is 185 grams of flour, four eggs, a packet of baking powder, a packet of vanilla sugar, 150 grams of regular granulated sugar, whipping cream that is under 35% fat, a pan that's in the shape of a lamb, and some butter in order to butter and flour your pan. Now that we have all the ingredients here in front of us, let's get started. The first step is to preheat the oven to 180 Celsius or 350 Fahrenheit. The next step is to grease and flour our pan. The next step is to separate our yolk from our whites. Next, we are going to beat the yolks with the 150 grams of sugar. Mm -hmm. 
then we beat the egg white. The recipe I found doesn't say how long, but I'm thinking since later in the recipe it says to fold into, I'm thinking it's probably supposed to beat it until it turns into that white foam. So but now we have this beautiful white foam. Now, in a third bowl, we are to whip the cream. I whipped it into a foam because I assume that's the only reason for whipping the whipped cream. Next, we are told to add the flour, baking powder, and the vanilla sugar into our egg yolk mixture. No! <laughs> I'm not sure I was supposed to do that, but I did. Okay, then it says to add the whipped cream. Next, we are to fold in the egg white. Gently fold in the egg white. Hopefully it tastes good when we're done. Fits perfectly. I guess the author of this recipe knew exactly what size pan I was gonna buy. Now we are to bake it in the oven. Set timer. How long? 45 minutes. 45 minutes. Starting now. Number four, pomlaska. Make a pomlaska, which is simply a whip made out of willow tree branches. They take the young branches of a willow tree and the men make a whip out of them. Yes, that's what I said, a whip. Number five, Easter Monday. Yes, Czechs have Easter Monday. I'm not sure why, but there are many traditions that go along with Easter Monday. So if you wanna celebrate Easter like a Czech, then participate in Easter Monday. Warning, Easter Monday isn't quite as fun for women. Easter Monday is probably quite fun for men. So the man takes that palm laska that I told you to make, and he actually whips you with it. <laughs> and these spankings, oh, our dog doesn't like that at all. And these spankings will guarantee you health and beauty for the coming year. In order to get that, you in turn offer a shot of Slivovice or an egg. All right, I'll take the egg. Now, the bonus tip I was going to tell you about that they only do in Moravia is even worse for women. In Moravia, they take... <gasps> <laughs> they take, they douse you with water instead of whipping you. And in turn, you still have to offer sleeve, I would say. But I'm American, so I'm taking it myself. Well, since I got whipped and doused with water, maybe this year I'm going to be twice as healthy and twice as beautiful. If you liked that video, hit that like button, subscribe to my channel, hit the notification button, and check out these videos as well.